Lubaina Hamid makes history as she becomes oldest winner of the Turner Prize and the first black woman to pick up the Art Award. Lubaina Hamid has become the first black woman to win the Turner Prize. The Zanzibar-born, 63-year-old artist also became the oldest winner when she picked up the award at a ceremony at the UK's current city of culture, Hull. She was praised by the judges for her uncompromising tackling of issues including colonial history and how racism persists today. Hamid celebrates black creativity and the African diaspora with her work, which includes paintings, prints, drawings and installations. A key figure of the black arts movement, she currently lives and works in Preston. The shortlist for the best-known accolade in British art had included, for the first time, Two artists who are over 50, British painter Hervine Anderson, 52, as well as Hamid. They were competing against German artist Andrea Butner and Palestinian English artist Rosalind Nashashibi, who are in their 40s. According to the BBC, the judging said of Hamid that they admired her expansive and exuberant approach to painting which combined satire and a sense of theatre. They also said they acknowledged her role as an influential curator and educator who continues to speak urgently to the moment. More than 90,000 people have visited the Turner Prize exhibition in Hull's refurbished Friends Art Gallery and, on Tuesday night, the British art establishment gathered in Hull Minster for the presentation by the musician, DJ and actor, Goldie. Martin Green, director of Hull 2017, said, Bringing world-class art and artists to Hull has not just been significant for the city but also the wider region and the north. The popularity of the exhibition shows the demand and interest for art in the region and confirms Hull's place as a cultural destination capable of hosting international art and cultural events. Leader of Hull City Council Stephen Brady said, the Turner Prize has been a major highlight in the Hull UK City of Culture program and has helped to put Hull on the international map. It is incredible for the city to host this fantastic exhibition and has generated so much interest and curiosity from residents and visitors alike, showing intrigue in contemporary art. This is an incredibly exciting time for the artists and the gallery. The Turner Prize award is £40,000 with £25,000 going to the winner and £5,000 each for the other shortlisted artists. As well as considering older artists for the first time. This year's prize was noted for a return to more traditional forms. Anderson, who was born in Birmingham and currently lives and works in London, is known for his vibrant still life and landscape paintings with an overarching theme of community. For Butner, who is based in London and Berlin, the limitations of the body are a frequent source of inspiration, and her diverse portfolio includes works of printmaking, sculpture, painting, film and collaborative projects. Croydon-born, London-based Nasha Shibi works primarily in film and also paints and creates prints, often fusing the different art forms together, and she drew on domestic life in Gaza and the political background for her piece Electrical Gaza 2015. When judging panel chairman Alex Farkarson visited the exhibition in September he said that it was a really strong year and thought the work was no less innovative for taking a more traditional form. Turner Prize 2017 will continue to be open to the public at the Friends until January 7th.